Hi, sir. How are you? Yes. Hi. I'm good. Thanks for asking. How about you? How is your I'm day going so far? My day is my day is going good. I am also good. Oh, that's great to hear. So, as we are meeting for the first time, so would yes, you sir. mind introducing yourselves, please? Yes, sir. My name is Bhagyatri. I am from Karnataka. I have a married. I'm pursuing BCA online degree. Oh, okay. You are pursuing BCA degree online. Yes. So, what do you want to do in your life? Do you want to be a teacher? Do you want to work for IT? I want to Software? work in IT. Or you want to work in IT sector? Oh. That's great to hear about you. I think so. Is there any need of my introduction, or you know about me? Yes, sir. I know, but you you say. Oh, okay. So when it comes to my introduction, my name is Ashutosh Sivedi, and I am speaking to you from Kanpur, Uttar Pradesh. About my education, I am pursuing a master's degree, that is Master's of Arts in English Literature. And I run a YouTube channel, which is based on spoken English conversations, and I help people to speak better English. That's all about myself. Thank you. Okay, sir. Okay. When you start YouTube channel? How I started my YouTube channel? I started my channel in 2021. So I started my spoken English journey in 2020. And when I did practice for eight or nine months, I felt like, you know, like just, you know, starting my own YouTube so I can boost my confidence because I used to have conversation through audio calls, but I wanted to become confident while on camera. So then I started in March 2021. So I started okay. making videos and then started talking to people through Skype. So okay. it's been more than three years. That's how I started my YouTube. Okay, sir. When you started YouTube channel, that time you can speak very confidently in front of person. I was not very confident, I would say, but I was able to speak. As I said, I practiced uh, eight or nine months before starting my channel. So I was able to speak, but speaking on camera is totally a different skill from speaking English on audio calls. Because when you speak on audio calls, you feel really comfortable, no agitation, no okay. nervousness. But when you come on camera, and speak with somebody, you get a lot of fear inside. So yes. that used to happen with me as well. I was not experienced at all when I started my journey, but literally I started improving day by day. When you make video conversations, you become better at it. So I was able to speak a bit, but I was not comfortable on camera for sure. Okay, okay. When you started YouTube channel, how to practice that time? You are speaking so, in front of you and uh, you are, you speak your own self. Yes, I used to use many platforms. As I uh, said, I used to do practice that buddy talk, hello talk, clubhouse, WhatsApp groups, where I used to interact with the people on audio calls. And for video, I used to speak in front of mirror. I used to see myself that how am I speaking? And sometimes I used to record my own videos also. I uh, just whatever the conversation I used to do, I used to watch it that how am I doing it? So that's how I improved. If you do more and more conversation and if you listen to your own conversation, you will be able to know your own mistakes. That way you can improve and your facial expression is good or not. So that's how I did. Okay. Sir, when you realized that I can speak very confidently without stuck? Actually, it's all about people and it's all about your practice. When you speak to the people, if somebody say like you are you are a very nice speaker, so it's not I felt uh, inside that I'm a good at all. But when somebody says that you are speaking good English and you sound really nice, then I felt I can express myself. So I would say like after one year or like you know, at least in 2021, when I started my journey on YouTube, after a few months, I felt that I was comfortable expressing myself. But it's never ending journey. So it's been approximately three to four years on three years on YouTube and four years for my spoken English journey. But there are still many things to improve. But I can speak. I can manage the conversation. But there are many things like if you want to improve your vocabulary, then you have to work for like, you know, it specifically. So that's how it is. But after one year, I felt that I was able to speak English. But I started practicing and I was always practicing, I would say. Practice is very important. So I think I want to ask one question is uh, practice oneself is uh, important uh, and uh, rather than 
talk with in front of person it's very important to do practice with the real person right because if you do have this option why to go for talk, like you know talking to yourself if you do not have any option then it's okay to talk to yourself because all the time you cannot talk to people right 24/7 so if you do not have any english partner speak to yourself but if you have english partner in your surrounding maybe if you have a friend try to have conversation with them every day because this is real conversation that's how you will improve right because if i would say like if you are practicing mm, dance actually maybe if you are practicing dance at your home that's good but if you get a lot of chances to perform on a stage you will become a better professional right you will become a better dancer so the same with english if you practice with yourself that's okay but when you speak to people you become better as a speaker and public speaker so you can speak to the people comfortably right okay okay sir yeah okay so what about you why would you like to improve your spoken english i want to become a it i want to become engineer as in the it sector they uh, without english they nobody nobody language can't accept that is the reason no sir i live in bangalore so what's your in first language my first language is a kannada oh it's kannada because you were born and raised in karnataka no sir i born and brought up in maharashtra my married got karnataka Oh, you were born and raised in Maharashtra, but you got married in Karnataka. Then why your language is Kannad? Because in Maharashtra it's Marathi. Ah, uh, Marathi. I know Marathi. I know four languages. Oh, you know four languages: Marathi, Hindi, Kannada. English, oh. Kannad. Oh, that's great to hear. Okay. So, what do you do? How long have you been practicing English, and what do you do to improve your English? starting time i only learned so grammar rules so many grammar rules then after i realized realized and i started to talk my own self and in front of mirror and started record my own self in, in front of the camera that time i made so many mistake and uh, repeat i learned grammar and then after i realized ki i should be i should be practice vocabularies then after i write down then after i, I then after i started to write down vocabularies i so one month i uh, practice so many vocabularies then after i started to talk with me and in front of person oh that's good so how long have you been practicing with people uh, face to face or do you do any audio conversation yes, do you I, use I, any application okay i downloaded one ma'am youtuber ma'am suggestion me as fluency app then after i downloaded and talk in uh, to people on the audio call that time i realized okay. that i need to practice so much my own self then after i can use this app okay then you started practicing by yourself in front of camera or you were talking to yourself right then yes. so nowadays do you do do you use that ace fluency app yes sir and there I is mean. another application that is speakify cv speakify yes, where we I get have. 30 minutes every day for free mm mm-hmm. I practice on this app, two app, every day. Oh, two apps. Okay, as, that's as nice. As well as I, as well as I practice vocabulary, new new vocabularies and new new stories. I write down my book, read the sentence oh, today. Okay. I practice and I learn all these all things. Use these uh, vocabularies and I write down one story. Oh, that's really nice. That is a practical way to learn vocabulary. It's very nice. So, uh, like. What kind of problems do you face when you speak English? I can speak basically, but I can't speak random topic. That time I have to face some problem and vocabulary problem. That time I forget vocabularies. I know vocabularies, but that time I forget vocabularies. I need to talk. Okay. I need to learn a random topic. I want to discuss anything random topic with them, but but uh, you even don't want to talk like that. Uh, good people in this app. i have to face some problem yeah it happens with everybody of course it's very difficult to find a sincere community uh, like you know mm-hmm. communicator or sincere partner so yeah, you are part- right oh. at that time i face in front of person talk with me good way that time i will talk with them good way and in front of person starting to flirting with that time i immediately disconnect call that time i don't have so much time that that, that time i don't want to waste my time 
Yes, you are absolutely right. So this is the right way to disconnect with the people and tell them that I'm here to practice English. I'm oh. not here for all these things, but it I happens. Already, it's very common. I already, uh, mm -hmm. I already told my purpose only practice and fluent English. You can talk my good way. I will talk with you. No, otherwise I will disconnect. Call no issue. Mm, yes, yes, I got it. Okay, so you cannot, as you said, you cannot talk on random topics. So what I suggest you. Uh, to better to find some friends actually and make some friends even though on those applications also if, if you find a girl like who is really nice or who can be your friend then you can exchange maybe the social media accounts and numbers so then you can talk to them so it is very important to have friend and discuss multiple topics with them what you can do you can read some topics like maybe you can read some articles like traveling uh, school, education, many topics are there, right? To discuss. So that's yes. how you can do it day by day. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. I, I, I may, I become, become one ma'am. She's a lecturer. She can talk with me one hour. And uh, every day discuss, started to discuss anything random topic. I will give you one suggestion every day. And then after she talking and she also given me any suggestion. I recollect the so many vocabularies. I first practice my own self and in uh, tomorrow I will talk with ma'am yeah that's really nice so that's what i said it is very important to have some good friends in this journey so you can improve but so now asking some uh -huh. mm -hmm. basic basic no but basic who the person basic no this is not improve you know you can discuss without facing a random topic that time you are improve english yes of course even though i do the same practice with my students i do not tell them that what i'm going to talk today I ask them topic actually randomly and whatever the topic I get, I ask them because, yeah, if you do a lot of preparation uh, means you talk like whatever you read that would you speak. But maybe because, because it's English, right? If you go on railway station, maybe if you go to interview, so you do not know what they are going to ask you. They can ask anything, whatever they want. So you have to be ready to give answer, right? Hmm. So, yes. These so now things. coming to some. These are things I want to learn that kind of I want to discuss that kind of but I don't have any person that is the reason I did. I also talking my own self every day so much. I'm thinking every day so much in my in my mind. Yes, I can understand but don't worry keep practicing you would get some people and you can join some WhatsApp groups are also there actually there are some WhatsApp groups if you will join there you can get some good friends and you can talk to them every day. But I don't know so much about, but one ma'am suggested me and downloaded this app. But I always away from social media and nobody YouTuber in my family. That is the reason I will, I hide on my face. They started to co negative comment on me. That comment I can't face. Yeah, social media, I would say that's social media. It's good and bad both. You cannot expect positive but, comments but, uh, all the time. Okay, mm -hmm. sir, but you want to use social media good way that kind of you you also care you are so good and you want to use bad way that kind of social media for you bad different different on you sir you can use good way it depends on you but if you uh, put the content on social media you cannot think that nobody is going to give you the negative comment even though whenever I upload my videos I cannot say that everybody will appreciate me or everybody will write something good about me. Maybe sometimes they will write something bad about me as well, right? So it's very common. So do you have a YouTube channel as well? No, sir. I don't have any YouTube channel. I'm just learner only, beginner my own self. I want to become my own self. I'm not, don't want to famous. <laughs> oh, you don't want to be on YouTube. You want to be fluent in English. That's what your goal. Okay, I got it. Yeah, that's really good. Okay, now another question goes to you. So related to your like, you know, personal life, what are your hobbies? Do you do something whenever you feel bored or whenever you get free time? Okay, this time only oh, only one my hobby is reading book and uh, reading book and write down story and become and fluent only good speaker like that. You, yeah, so that's your I'm only the, goal right now. Mm -hmm. I'm also your so fan, sir, big fan. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you so much. So at this moment, you have only one goal that you want to be fluent in English as uh, early as possible, right? Yes. Sir. Okay, so what kind of books do you read? Do you like reading books? Yes, 
yes sir i i speech so i listen so much speech your speech conversation videos and sudha murthy ma'am oh wow yeah she is always a great speaker oh. and many many people told me that she has really written good books also and ha she give you motivational she always uh, uh, telling us motivational words anything too much mm-hmm. is bad anything too much is bad anything whatever you want to do limit you have to take you have to keep a limit that kind of mm. yes she is a wonderful speaker and wonderful person i would say okay. so what now asking to some questions to you related to travel do you like traveling no sir i i don't like travel my this purpose my the nowadays purpose only focus on my study i love study i love learn the english i love speak english oh nowadays it's your goal but have you traveled many state in your life when you were at school or college so yes. did you visit many places in maharashtra or karnataka yes i i love travel yeah so tell me about your best journey which you had best place you visited so far bangalore oh bangalore so how is bangalore actually nowadays you live in bangalore right yeah yes sir i am so tell me something about bangalore how it looks like and how is that city for you ba- bangalore is a garden city and silicon valley of india bangalore is the most popular in it industry city bangalore is a so much big city is a costly city sir and uh, south indian people south indian dish sir you know already is a famous in world famous south indian dishes and uh, bangalore only it it industry it's famous for it sector right it sector and most of the people from uh, come from all around the country or other only states industry. to do work here in bangalore uh, engineer purpose study purpose mm-hmm. yes exactly for study for education for job all those things yeah. so do you like this city do you like living in bangalore or do you like living in maharashtra no sir i love bangalore oh you love bangalore more than maharashtra so where were you in maharashtra what uh, like you know, what about nagpur nasik or nasik. city or any you were no, in nasik sir, i am from village side village side nanded is district nanded district oh nanded I, i know mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Nanded okay, TV but TV. you like Bangalore because it's a city with everything. You oh. get everything, whatever you want. But Nanded was not that much developed, right? It was underdeveloped, you can say. Oh. Nanded is a TQ, sir. He's a Karnataka capital, no Bangalore. Yes, of course. It's a wonderful city. Uh, oh. I think it's a very nice city, like you know, for Indians. So oh. yeah, it's okay. and now coming to the question of like speaking so how many hours do you speak to improve your english every day two and three hour i give time for english purpose and talking purpose otherwise i write down my story whatever i thinking in my mind this is the good topic i will write down my book okay so means two to three hours you give every day to speak english that's good of course and how long have you been practicing how many months it has been i have been practice only one month ago oh wow you are speaking really nice and you have a confidence to speak on camera within a month that's oh. really amazing you are a wonderful speaker i would say because within a month it's it's very difficult for somebody to come on only camera even month. though i was not able to do so far I think one month I downloaded this app and started only I have only thirty minute and she is in front of person is good I can talk with them so many time in front of person is not good I can't talk with them that time I will irritate my own self. Yeah, it happens. Even though it used to happen with me also when I started my journey, I would get many people who were not speaking in a right way who were not there to practice english only they wanted to kill their time they wanted to pass time they wanted to make fun of others even though now this also it happens sometime so it's very common but later you will you will get some good people so it takes time uh, sir boys no can't understand study values language values they always want to waste their time whenever time they uh, started got married that time they realized study values the when the time they started mm. working in farm that time they realized this time also they want to waste their time they enjoying this time no sir 
because their father is given money they were father is uh, uh, father is not caring them no exactly they do not understand the value of time in this age and later they regret once they work for this agriculture or they go to delhi and do basic jobs it happens with most of the people and that's how it is what we can do actually never never come gone time who mm. is the people understand they will immediately act, act uh, they will success sir who the person understand never came gone time they will uh, success yes exactly if time you spend time and you just wasted time does not come back that's really important yeah you are absolutely right okay so thank you so much and do you have any question for me at the end of the session it was really nice talking to you i would say but you are such a good speaker within a month you are able to do a lot i was not able to think about video conversations in a one month i it took almost 8 or 9 months then i thought about video conversations and i was not at all comfortable when i started video conversations but you are marvelous and you are a good speaker that at least you have a courage to face camera within a month for sure you are going to be a fluent speaker nobody can stop you if you are consistent and if you do practice every day thank sure. you thank you sir thank you so much thank you thank you yeah so so do you have any question for me at the end of the session okay i i have question sir i want to ask whenever to how to practice vocabulary is how to remember vocabulary is in your mind yeah it's a big i would say the topic and a big question uh, all the learners have their in, in mind so what i used to do basically when i started then i used to write down a lot of words maybe 10 or 15 words but it was not working if you write a lot of words 10 words 15 words so means in 10 days it would be 150 words okay but you would not be able to use all those 150 words in your conversation then there mm. there is no use of all those words so better to pick few words okay pick 5 or 10 in a week but try to use them repeatedly in your conversation make them part of your conversation and learn practically how maybe when you are listening to a video if you find some good words two or three words maybe if you are watching a video of 10 or 15 minutes if you got two words and three words write them down and try to use them in your conversation make them make sentences from it and as you said like make a story and if you are reading an article if you get some words write down so do not write a lot of words try to write few words and but use them in your conversation because if you do like 10 words in in a day okay so it means 70 words in a week but you will not be able to use 70 words in your conversation for sure I, I, I it's very very difficult ha huh? you cannot remember though so it's important to have like 5 or 10 words in a week but try to use them in your conversation consciously while okay. you are speaking to people that is okay. very important so learn few words but use them repeatedly in your conversation and learn words which are important in daily conversational skills or in your conversation you know you do not have to learn some words which you do not use or you will not get any situation to use them okay right? okay which the words is very important and they use uh, for ever time that kind of words i i should be learn now i should be remember no exactly which are important for your conversational skills because if you will read a novel you will get a lot of words maybe okay. if you are reading a book from literature you will get many words but they are very difficult so you will not be able to use in your real conversation or live conversation so it's better to learn words which you can use them in your conversation okay ha huh. thank you thank you sir thank you okay so okay. thank you so much menwir thanks to you for joining me and i must say to you you are a good speaker and all the best keep practicing within 6 months you will be able to do wonders Oh, thank you so thank much you, sir, really you are given me blessing <laughs> good blessing thank you thank you thank you yeah. sir yeah pleasure mine bye bye take care